a public opinion poll which shows she's the greatest ever monarch, even ahead of Queen Victoria. Britain's Queen Elizabeth has another reason to be cheerful in her Diamond Jubilee year. Her annual pay is about to jump by 20% to £36 million. Her property holdings, known as the Crown's Estate, posted a record profit of £240 million, a net rise of 4%, largely due to strong tenant demand for its shops in the upmarket Regent Street and St. James districts of London. At a time when Britain is in recession and many families are feeling the pinch of higher household costs and taxes, the Queen's allowance will rise to £36 million from £30 million. Crown's estate CEO Alison Nimmo said, It's a great set of results and I'm sure everyone's going to be happy. The Queen has been paid by taxpayers through an allowance set by Parliament and by other government grants since King George III ceded all property profits to the Treasury in 1760. The Crown's estate pays all of its profit to the Treasury or Finance Ministry. Under new laws that come into effect in 2013, the monarch's pay is calculated as 15% of the estate's profits from two years prior. The changes were designed to ensure the Queen's pay would rise and fall with the health of the British economy, which this year entered its second recession since the start of the global financial crisis. The Queen's 2013 and 2014 pay will be the highest since 2008, though still less than half of her 1991 pay of £77 million, used mainly to pay the royal household staff as well as for items like laundry, stationery, and official functions. The Crown's estate owns a mix of wind farms, retail parks, and most of Britain's seabed in addition to its central London properties. The property holdings outperformed the industry's Investment Property Data Bank Benchmark Index due to strong international interest in the London property market and the country's growing dependency on renewable energy. The 85-year-old Queen celebrated her 60th year on the throne this month with a 1,000-vessel flotilla on London's River Thames and nationwide street parties.